Hello everyone, welcome back to another Star Stable video. <laughs> I feel like it's been so long. I feel like it has, but it's only been two days and I'm back. Okay, that was a really weird intro, but today is the last day before the Halloween event in Star Stable. Honestly, this is one of my favorite events. I feel like I say this about every single event when it is time for it, but hey, I'm a little biased during times of the year, apparently. I don't know. When Winter Village comes around, I'm gonna be saying that's my favorite. But anyways, we have some things that you should make sure you do today since it is the last day to prepare and get ready for the Halloween event, which always has a bunch of free items, pets. We usually at least get one free pet, so count on that. New horses, events, quests, and so much more. So without any further ado, let's get into the video then. Let's go. With the arrival of the Halloween event, that means that the midsummer area is going to be completely converted to, you know, have the Halloween portal, everything like that, so non-star riders and people in Moreland can access it. Alongside this though, that means the Horse Bazaar is officially and finally leaving. Star Stable also confirmed this to be true over on their Instagram that everything from the Bazaar is going to be leaving October 11th. Well, not everything. I should say the discounts are going to be leaving. The only real item or pet, I should say, that is going to be leaving forever from this Horse Bazaar are the pet pigs. Okay, so last chance, literally final chance in the history of of Star Stable to buy the pet pigs. Okay, bestie, so if you want a pet pig, definitely go down to the bazaar today and buy them because Star Stable said they are never coming back. Okay, you need to go get them. And if you are someone who is waiting on the horse discounts or you've been saving up, you need to buy the horses now because they are not going to be discounted. This is their final day being discounted. So don't waste your star coins and make sure that you buy those discounts if you want the items discounted, anything like that then definitely go check it out before it leaves tomorrow. So very, very last chance here. Next, I always recommend looking through your inventory and finding any old tokens. So there are two tokens you wanna be looking for, Soul Shards, the new variation, although the old variation still works, and Autumn Tokens. Autumn Tokens look like a little pumpkin kind of thingy, but those two are the currency that are going to be used throughout the Halloween event. So if you have any spare ones from last year, I definitely recommend looking through your inventory and making sure that you put them because let me tell you, you are going to want those and any extra tokens that you have had from previous years are definitely going to help you in this situation. So make sure to put those in your inventory so you don't have to keep going back and forth. Although remember, Star Stable does give us an inventory little like home stable storage over at the Halloween events. So if you forget, it is not too much of a big deal. Just don't forget that you have them in your storage and don't use them at all because that's kind of waste basket. So get that, get good, get good. Two new horses are going to be joining the Halloween event this year. These are Audra and Elvira. Here they are on screen. Make sure that you save up for the ones that you want or know in advance if you are someone that spends too many star coins and just buys too many horses during the events. Keep in mind, these are going to be limited time horses and only staying here for the Halloween event. So you still have time to decide which ones you want and they're not going to be released tomorrow. Okay, Basti, they're coming in a separate smaller Halloween update, which I think is next, next week. Next, go through your home stable. Make sure your horses are happy. Little tip, because you are going to be running all around the map with all of the quests. So make sure that your horses are happy or, you know, if you have the money, do the vet, okay. But choose horses that you wanna train specifically. I recommend spooky horses since it is the Halloween season, but of course, just any horses you need to train because when the Halloween event comes to Star Stable, there's always, always high XP races and you definitely wanna make sure that you're taking advantage of these. So make sure you have a low level 
horse because if you're on a level 15 horse there's going to be quest xp right off the bat you're going to miss for your horse and also you'll probably have to do the race the first time to be like oh here's the race and that usually gives a lot of xp so make sure that you have a horse that you want to train and that you're ready and prepared in this way you don't get to gallopers keep and you're like oh my gosh my horse is level 15 let me go all the way back although another tip i do recommend if you're someone who wants to speedily get through the quest then girl you're gonna need not a level one horse or a level two horse i recommend anything level 10 plus okay because you need the speed stats we're not about that so i recommend that if you want to get the quest done super fast so keep that in mind Now is a great time to get on your account and make sure that your outfit is ready and prepared for the Halloween event. Honestly, this is so much fun and there will be so many more items that you want to look out for. Star Sable is also releasing a lot of sets, so be on the lookout for those. I will show those on screen right now so you know kind of what direction they're going in and what you want to save for, what sets you might want. But be aware those sets might be part of a bundle, you know, where you can only buy them through a bundle or it might be a soul shard exchange. So they might not all cost star coins, so be aware of that. But get on your account and make yourself an outfit so you feel prepared for the Gallopers Keep release. Also, good tack outfit. Again, if you wanna get through things very fast, I recommend, because it is so annoying to look around for ingredients on a low stat tack. It is so much slower, so definitely get good stats while still staying fashionable. It is a little bit of a challenge, but you got it. Make sure your inventory is clear and take all the ingredients, all of them, because on the trail ride, you will be so annoyed if you're like, oh, I need one more bone and you have it in your inventory. So you have to go all the way out of the trail ride and all the way back. Put those items in your inventory right now and also clean it out so you have space for free items. Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching this Star Stable video. As always, I hope this was helpful and I'm so excited for the Halloween update. There's always a lot to do and check out. So, yeah, bestie. Bye bye! Stay tuned because I'll put like little tips and little like tricks and little like locations. So, yeah. Bye bye!